you update us on Jonas' status? Hey, Andrew, we'll, uh, we've got him immobilized right now. Um, he'll uh, he'll get an MRI tomorrow, and we'll we'll know a little bit more on Monday. Can you evaluate Tommy's play today? I, we won again. <laughs> I think he's twelve and two as a starter. It's pretty pretty good. I don't know if you guys know that twelve and two is pretty good as a starter. Brian, here to your right. Could you comment on how I mean, your field position was, was <laughs> awful all day? Could yeah. You, Comment on how that impacted your offense. Oh, it, it, you know, give credit to Boston College now too. You know, they they, they played well. Um, they look coming in three and seven. You know, th this was their ball game and they played hard. And uh, Coach Paziani had those kids playing hard, physical. But the field position obviously was difficult to manage, and the weather. You know, the weather elements out there were difficult. They were, it was very blustery, and so we had to manage. And um, you know, we. We, we knew what kind of game this was going to end up being, uh, and it, it certainly turned out that way. Brian, over here, do you have any type of feel with Jonas? I mean, he obviously has been a key player senior day, and then NBC, I think, reported that it was an ACL, which would be pretty serious. They, they know more than I do, and I was just in the training room okay. with our doctors. So they want to get an MRI and, and, uh, and, and get a good look at that. You talked earlier in the week about the two linebackers and they, I don't know how much with watching the ball and calling plays you got to see, but they had a pretty classic battle today. Can you talk about what you saw? Yeah, they're both. Uh, I think I mentioned that uh, to Alex Flanagan before we went on NBC. Uh, both those guys are going to be all over the field tonight. I, I knew Keekly would be. You saw it on the very first play. He went sideline to sideline and Man Manti played great. It was, it was just really good college, throwback, gritty, tough. You know, last possession stop. It, it was uh, it was good stuff. Brandon, right here, just I guess overall your defense, though, obviously, basically with the exception of two drives. Yeah, I mean they gave up 250 yards in total offense. I think, you know, two two drives. You know, we got into uh, you know two third down situations that they converted on the first score, and then the last score. You know, we got into some dime where they ran the ball and, and had a couple of plays. But really, right, if you look at it. You know, we kicked the ball out of the uh, out of play. You know, start on the forty. You got a fifteen yard personal penalty, personal foul penalty, and that never really put him in a pretty good position. But no, it, defense played very very stout today and um, found a way to win. You know, we had uh, Harrison Smith in, in the uh, in the infirmary uh, last night uh, getting IVs. We had uh, Zach Martin out. We, Stephon Tuitt couldn't. Couldn't play because of illness. Um, R.J. Blanton uh, didn't practice for two days because of illness, and all of that. And I can give you all the injuries: Braxton Cave, uh, Cap Lewis. I could go on and on. My point is this: those kids stepped up um, in November, and with with a lot of guys out, found a way to win.